What's up? I'm Troubleshoot. Welcome back to another video. In this quick guide, I'll be showing you how to uninstall a program on Mac. If I open up my launchpad here, you'll see I have a program called Duplicity. I'd like to uninstall this. How do we do it? Well, the usual way of simply uninstalling something may leave a lot of files on your computer. But following similar steps, we can uninstall it as well as all of the files that are left behind from the program. If we open up our Finder instead of the launchpad and head across to Applications, you'll see a window that looks something like this. What we need to do is locate the program here. In my case, it's Duplicity. Usually, you'd right click and move to bin or drag this to the bin on your tray down here. But instead of doing that, we're going to go to the search button in the top right, then search for the name of the program. In my case, it's Duplicity, and you'll see a whole bunch of files that appear. Click the plus in the far top right over here, choose kind, and we'll select other. From here, search for system, and it'll be ticking system files here. Click OK. Now, when we click kind, we get system files in the drop down here. That's what we need to select. Then we'll change aren't included to are included. And just like that, we found a whole bunch of files that are related to this program that usually wouldn't be deleted when we uninstall it. What you'll want to do is wait for it to finish loading so it finds all of the different files. And when you're happy, scroll through the list to make sure there's not anything you don't want deleted here. It's not likely, but there may be a file here that you want to keep. When you're done, hit Command A to select everything and Command Backspace to delete them. You'll need to enter your password to uninstall the program as well. And just like that, a ton of files will be moved to the bin and the program will be completely uninstalled. If we open up Launchpad once more, the program here is gone. Now, if you're not happy removing all of these files yourself, there are uninstaller programs that will do this for you. Or of course, you can simply resort to right click, move to bin, or dragging it to the bin yourself. This way you can reclaim a bit more space than just simply uninstalling something, but it may be a bit scarier for normal users. Anyways, that's about it for this quick guide. Thank you all for watching. My name's been Troubleshoot, and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.